<sighs> that was one heck of a journey, wasn't it? We return with part 9 of Link's Awakening. We've completed the final dungeon in the game. Because you have to ask yourself, where do we go from here? Well, first things first, I need to restock. <laughs> Restocking so that way I can be ready for the end game. I kind of like going overkill on this one. So you know what we're going to be doing today? We're going to be hunting down every single... Yeah. We're going to be hunting down every single seashell. Yeah, we got to find all the secret shells. And there's a lot. Now, we've already gotten some that we've had on this journey. We have like 10 shells. You need a total of 50. Wait a minute. Okay, now there's something interesting. Okay, how's this gonna work out well? Because there's actually one of those plank things. Okay. Ugh. You kidding me? I miss? Yeah, it's another slap! But what for? Oh. Yeah, 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 challenge again. Now I'm gonna wait till it moves all the way across and then move it gently. Got it! <laughs> and it told me two tries, too. But I have to ask, what is it? Oh. I know the other one you require, like, what? I don't know, like, 200, like, 1,280 rupees? This is a chamber stone. Why does it feel so strange? Well, a chamber stone truly is interesting. Wonder there's anything else that they added in this one. Heart piece. Yeah. I'm adding that in, too. You can think of it as, like, part of a a two-parter where we clean things up. Alright. Yeah, I missed it. Yeah, looks like we're also going to be getting every heart piece, too. So, basically, we're going to be cleaning things up. Because... I don't leave empty-handed. I never do. Ooh. And I know there's already fan art of all of it regarding the... This challenge. And how insane that Link loses to the Crane game. It's stupid, I know, but... Hey, it's worth it. Are you kidding me? That's twice now I lost to the Crane game? All I want is to get another piece of heart. I have like 14 hearts and I need six more hearts and six more hearts to reach the maximum of 20. I am not gonna lose with the crane game. That's three times now. Three times I've lost this thing all because I want to get a heart piece. Ooh. Yeah, I know. Let's try it again. Four times. I'm not gonna lose this damn thing. I've already wasted like 50 rupees on this thing. Hmm. Right here. Still doesn't work. God damn it! Thank you. 
I know exactly where to move it. Right here. Yeah! Got it! Told me six tries just to get a piece of heart. He actually had two pieces of heart. No, I'm happy with what I got. Nice. What a rare find. Very rare. Because now I gotta work my butt off trying to get the rest. Not to mention these stone tablets. Is there anything else? Game, what the hell? The crane is merciless. The crane is despicable. And now I gotta do it to get a seashell. And I know how I'm gonna do it. Now. Yeah! Yeah, take that! What the?! What the?! Are you kidding?! Come on! I hate you. I hate you, game. I hate you, crane game. You had to move. Uh, you know what? Let's reset it. Because for some. Because I'm not going to waste my time over it. I mean, good God. I had it and then it fell off. Yeah, yeah. Let me. Let me play the damn game. There you go. Can we, like, pray and not make the same mistake twice? This time it doesn't... <laughs> no thanks, I got what I need. F that. Nice. Put it to your ear and we'll hear those whispered secrets. I mean, do I have to get like more seashells in this game? Cause this crane game sucks. Good, I'm not coming back here. Good, cause I ain't coming back here. And dear God, that was nuts. I'm thankful I was able to get it. So now the next step is to... Oh yeah. Let's head to the Cell Manson and get our hands on it. We got more shells to get. Not here, but here. I want to make sure I have enough to get the stronger sword. I also want to make sure I'm prepared up and ready to go. This was the shell that I missed. This makes 12 shells. Chamber stones. Mysterious stones that give you an ember feeling. Yeah, eat that. There's next shell somewhere around here. Let's take care of these mobs first. These mamas are mad. Shovel, please. Ah, oh, there it is. Another one in the bag. Oh yeah, there's also the matter of that mermaid. So let's take care of it. When I was swimming in the bay, the waves took a very important necklace from around my neck. If you find it, I will let you take a scale from my tail. Then who do I give the hibiscus to? Now 
No. There. Zoom in. Now we gotta find that out. There's like an owl statue somewhere around here. It's all the way on the left. Oh yeah, cracked area. Very nice. That's better. So I push this block and then what? Or do I have to shovel it? I'm just as stumped about it as you guys are. All right, got the next one. That's nice. Still can't understand about this. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Another warp point, and Martha's Bay. Yeah. Nice. This leads to an abandoned place here. Yup, the next seashell. Let's head here. Much better. Ah! 
Really? Gotta make sure I get in this. All right, that's another fairy dungeon, fairy area. There's also a piece of heart that we missed. This is where we got that chest that was a seashell inside. That's a relief. Got the next heart piece. Only need one more to raise my health up to 15. I wonder if there's anything else I haven't found. On an island near the mermaid statue. Now let's look for it. And that's an animal village. In the far right, there, far right corner of the desert. We'll have that there next. Delicious. Oh, yeah, I need a hook shot. By sure. A scale is missing. Nothing yet. Yeah, let's head for the desert. Hold on a sec. Okay, we're back. Uh, what I did that. Anyway, gotta, gotta move. Wait, 
Wait, what am I doing? Am I going all the way around? No, I'm heading in the wrong direction. Seems I have to head around here in the animal village. There we go. Now you head down here and you have to head to the desert. You gotta at least head around around here and then you go down. And you still can't lift that. Ow! That's better. Nice. That takes care of the next one. So now that we have that, what's our next step? Okay, I forgot about that. We're now back at Animal Village. And so far we have like 16. Look around. And it's found in this silent here. Now let's head to our next stop. Right up here. Telltale Heights. And yeah, we're probably going to be needing the hook shot. Like likes. Right here. Mm. You there, wanna go on a raft ride for 100 rupees? There are two ways to ride the rapids. With the rapids ready, the goal is pick up as many items as you can. The other way is the race, where you try to get at the end as fast as you can. Which course will you be setting today? The race. The rapids race. Okay, the rap is ready for you outside. Enjoy. This truly is a challenge. Oars up, the rapids race is over. 
Looks like that's a new record for you. Your time was 54.04s. Oh, you gotta go fast. Fine, let's race it. End up losing rubies, but who cares? Gonna use, use my hook shot as fast as possible. There's a chest in the middle. Nice, 39 seconds. I got hung up somewhere. I got a piece of heart. Very nice. Our hearts increased to 15. Now I gotta move faster than that. You gotta be faster. Thirty-eight fifty-six. Got hung up somewhere. And yes, you get more rupees. Let's go. Let's try it again. <laughs> hung up on there somewhere, eh? Thirty three seconds. Not bad, all things considered. You want a secret seashell? I hear collecting these things is all the rage now. You gotta be under thirty five seconds to get it. Yeah, let's go one more time. But this time we'll do something a little different the Rapids Raid. But this also means I'm going to have to grind. At least this time around, we don't have to worry. We just take our time. Wait, I need Rock's Feather for this? Oh, I see.
you know, this could actually be useful in grinding up to get more, more change. So, you may want to take advantage of it. Yep. actually rather interesting. That's like a lot of rupees that we got. No more grabbing stuff. The rapids race over. Want another go? Yeah. I want another go at it. Nice, we got the other heart piece. Nice, very nice. Let's see how many we got so far. Just one piece so far? Fair enough. And let's see what this one gives us. Very nice, 20 rupees, joy. Just letting you know that you could pretty much be, you could be grinding up rupees. Why I love using the hook shot so much. Come on. There's a lot of fun. And if you wanted to, you could just grind like for hours. I may take advantage of this to grind non-stop. And look at that, you already reached at 600 rupees. No thanks. That was a fun ride at least. At least we got the seashells out of it. Okay, I'll be right back. Gotta do s Never mind, I'll be right back regardless. Sorry about this. Let's continue. Anyway, we need to be on the move. And the next one we gotta find is around here. So let's head to Animal Village. And remember, there were some that I already got my hands on. And yeah, I had to interrupt most of it. Most of it was already cut off because, well, to be frank, it's just that I, I don't live by myself. If I did, I wouldn't have to... Yeah, I wouldn't have to worry about it. But the fact is that... Yeah, I always tell people to wait, but I guess patience doesn't exist in their vocabulary. Buzz off, Tektites. I won't need that piece of power for this. 
and it should be somewhere. It's either around here or around there. Ah, I hate these guys. Fine, if they got a problem, I'll take it up with my blade. Much better. And it's right around here. A st stairs. All that just for a seashell. Who to thunk? That at least is taken care of. Says we had to find it somewhere where the moblins were. And it was right up here. So we'll have to take the way to Mambo's Pond. Oh yeah, it's right around here. You're close to Telltale Heights. Dompish Shack is nearby. There it is. Got it. That was simple. So right now we have 21. We need at least 40 to get the coalant blade. And yeah, we'll also make sure to take care of the trade sequence. The next one is right around here. Nice. That wasn't so hard. That's 22. We gotta keep on moving. Or never mind, we don't have to. We just gotta keep moving. We just gotta keep going around. Move up and around, then head south. And yeah, we already got the flipper, so there's no need for us to worry. We just go here. There you have it. That's much better. Now we gotta head to Tal Tal Heights. We'll have to head there via the west side. Yeah, that means we're gonna have to go around. Wish there was one that was teleporting me on the east side. Oh, who am I kidding? How come there wasn't that little teleporter thing on the east side of Tao Tao Heights? Because honestly, there should have at least been one. And that means I'm going to have to go all the way up. Ah. 
Ow! Come on! We'll need Rock's Feather for this. Almost got this. Made it all the way to the mountain range. There's the cuckoo house. Wait, didn't we already got this? Oh wait, we did it. That takes care of this one. Now let's move it! No, wait a second. Yeah, because you need more to reach the other side. Shot just makes things so easy. And there's the entrance where need the egg could be. Out of here. We've gotten a good amount so far. Next stop is to reach the Tabula Wasteland. Got you with birds. There's also this thing. Nice, another piece of heart. We need one more to raise it up to 16. All right, got that one. Good. Now we gotta move. And I know I'm gonna have to start saving up a whole lot of rupees. Though the rupee ride thing, I can actually get like over 300 in one run. I'm already now at 26 and I only need, I'm already at the halfway point. Gotta head to the moblin. Get ahead of the lost woods. Okay. 
sorry, but I'm in no mood. supposed to find out the main entrance, right? Or is it here? Not that one. Booyah! Up and to the right. Alright, that's another one. <sighs> yep, there's also a heart piece that we need to get. on the west side of Tal Tal Heights. <laughs> Gotta move. Right around here, Seashell Manor. Yeah, we gotta find that waterfall. Or is it the fact you had to go around? And I know I will be back here to grind rupees up the wazoo. Now where's that waterfall? Here. Very good. At least with that, we get we're set. We already now have twenty nine. We only need eleven more. Said there was like a statue? Right here. <laughs> Gotta go around here, take the shovel. Nice, that's shovel number 30. I'm 
I'm hoping to at least make sure I get all of them. We gotta head to the Yarna Desert again. And we also gotta make sure to head to that exact spot where Marin played the Song of the Walrus to get another one. Right here. Where is it? Or did I already got it? Oh, you're supposed to play it again. All right. Oh. It ain't Marin, but at least that's something. Thanks. That's another seashell added. Okay. Another one in the bag. Yep, next stop we gotta go all the way around. Wait a minute. Let's head up there first. Remember that heart piece we missed? Yeah, there you go. We only need one more to raise our health up to 16. Wait, what am I doing? Come on, stop that, seriously. We only have 32, we need eight more. And yes, we already got the one in Eagle Dungeon. Now all we gotta do is follow the pathway that leads to a three-sided waterfall. There's a cave up there that we can't get, but there is something that we can. Okay, so now our next step is to hopefully... No, we're heading in the right path. Yeah, because now we gotta throw a bomb in. Throw a bomb here. Wait, something should happen. Oh, in the hole. There you go. And that's 34. We 
Very good. Oh, wait, we have the warp. Let's use that instead. Right here. Got it. All right, man, let's get out of here. We use it to get to the animal village. Oh yeah, we still gotta do the trade sequence. You know what, let's take care of that. What item do we have currently? Not the Xiao Xiao figure. Right there, the hibiscus. The hibiscus. We went through like a lot. Dog food, then we did the stick, honeycomb, pineapple, hibiscus. Oh yeah, you're supposed to trade it to the guy. We get to Animal Village in the second to last house. But which house is it? Which house is going to give it to us? Well, let's find out. Oh, you brought me a hibiscus? How sweet. Well, since you're such a gentleman, I have a request to make of you. Will you listen? I would like you to take this letter to a Mr. Wright who lives on the border of the mysterious borders, please. We trade this for a goat's letter. Right? All right. Now with this letter, we take it to the guy, the real right guy who's a not a sin city and make sure we reach up there. It's messy. An insane trading sequence, and I know we're already more than an hour in. Well, not really an hour in, because I was like, interrupted. Ow. Sorry. Managing. Out of the way. Now with this. What's this? A letter for me? I'm so happy. And look, the letter came with a photograph. Humor me, man. Hmm, she's so beautiful. I must give you something for your trouble. <sighs> hmm, well, it looks like all I have is this broom. How'll that be? That can do. You got a broom as a reward for Mr. Wright. But that photo was not of... Ugh. Well, what can you do? Okay, so our next stop now is that we have to head to Animal Village. Oh, wait. We gotta give that how give it to her so we can get a new broom. And that broom will lead to a necklace, and the necklace will lead to a scale. Now, where is her home? Ah, uh, there she is. Yahoo, Yahoo, a new broom? For me, it is, isn't it? Okay, in return, you're gonna have this fishing hook I found when I swept by the riverbank. Very nice. What will the fishing hook become? Now with this... We gotta find that stairwell. Right there! Oh, 
Oh, hello. Heart piece, thank you. This raises my health now up to 16. And yeah, you gotta wonder why it takes that long anyway. You'll see a stairway that leads into the water. find that stairway that leads into the water. Should be right around here. Go for a swim beneath the bridge in the south. Is this it? Ah, there it is. You have to wonder to yourself, how the heck am I having that health that high? I only need four more full hearts and I'm at a max of 20. Here, dude. Oh, what's that you have in your hand? It's not a fishing hook, is it? You better let me have it. I'll give you my next catch if you let me have it. Hmm. Keep your eyes open. Watch a pro at work. Hmm. Ah, that's a big one. The fishing hook became a necklace. L lucky. Thanks, man. Now with this necklace, we gave it to the mermaid who gives us a scale, and we use that scale to pretty much, like, unlock the magnifying glass. And we need that magnifying glass to unlock the next shell. Ah, that's it! That's my necklace! Give it! Give it back! I'll give you a scale as I said! Promise? You only take one. And one's all we need! Simple! We already know how we're gonna use it anyway. See you around. We only have like, we got like 35 and we only need 15 more. We need, like I said, we need 40 to get the, get the coal in play. And I think when we get 40, that'll probably do it. Well, that gotta suck. Oh yeah, you can actually take them down with this method. Okay, with this, we put the missing scale in the mermaid statue. Which opens up a stairwell. But there... What's going on here? No. And with this, we get the magnifying lens. This will reveal many things you couldn't see before. Yeah, like, what? Tell me, I have to ask. What? Alright, I'm actually getting more health. That's why, you couldn't see anything. You couldn't see anything, and with that, that was the problem. Now that we have the, now that we have it. Ah! Seriously, you're gonna smack me in the face with it? Darn it. Let's just in the meantime head back to the animal village. And it's that house right there. No, that ain't even it.
It ain't that one. That's where we had to trade the letter. Has to be this. Nope. Come on, this is already getting me confused. And that trade sequence was in fact a lot of work. Besides, I now have 35 and I need five more to get the blade. It's in the upper right. Anyway, let's just move on. We did get her the broom, so she's satisfied. Azora! Hey! You can see me! You must have a magnifying glass. I'm not a troublemaker, I just want to live in peace. I'll give you this if you promise to keep your mouth shut. Thanks. I'll need it. That's another seashell added to our collection. A promise is a promise, okay? Yeah, sure. Whatever you say. <sighs> Sad we already used the magnifying glass. Now the next step is to find now the next step is to find a shell that's like buried in an owl statue? Or did I already get it? Now I'm in the right path. <laughs> well, that's not my day. <laughs> yep, I already got it. Already got it. So our next stop is that we need to head to the back back of the first dungeon. Yeah, and that tree's right there. We just need a few more to get our hands on. That's another one. That's number 36, 37. We need three more. Once I get 40, then I'll save the rest for part two. Because some of them require to enter the remaining dungeon, I think. Fine, we're just gonna run in it. There you go. That's 38. Yep, two, two left. I only need 40. Yeah, this part two is gonna be all heart containers. And it's right around here. That's 39. That's 39. Now we need one more. I mean, 
means we gotta head back up north. We gotta find a patch of blue flowers. Okay, we got in our memories. Pieces of heart found. We have 39. Yeah. I like that. Now we gotta find a clearing where there are blue flowers. Not that one. Get off me! There it is! There you go! Alright, now the only thing remains is the head of the seashell mansion. Yep, time to reap the goods. That's taking a while. Okay, that's one gift. What does that give us? This is a seashell sensor. This will let you know when the seashell close by. What's the third gift? A chamber stone. Got the second one. And finally, the fourth. Raise your sword overhead. I shall grant you new power. We now have the colon sword. You should put your name on it right away. Yeah, we now have the second blade. A crafted sword where you were presented with at the Seashell Mansion. And basically... Yeah, basically... Takes out... It's a much stronger blade. A level 2 blade. Thank goodness for that. So yeah, that's a long one. I'm gonna save the rest for part 2. Because part two is when we get the rest, and then we do the final battle. That's going to be it for this part of The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. The cleanup will continue in the next one. If you enjoy it, be sure to hit the like button. It means a lot to me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. Helps out big time. This is Mega Man NG signing off. Peace out.